uh, the, that at bat? What pitch were you looking for? What did you get? And... Yeah. Uh, honestly, this weekend I hadn't been swinging it too well, as you uh, as you may know. And uh, honestly, just take it back a few at bats, right? Put a ball in there that just kind of bleeds, and uh, I kind of needed that a little slump buster, get me going a little bit there. And uh, and then after that, I just kind of had to trust myself and just trust my process and trust the routine. And during that last at bat, I knew I was going to get heaters. Wanted to see one. I knew he had nothing that could beat me. And then uh, saw the first fastball for a strike, and then fastball up and away for a ball. And I swung right through that fastball, good swing, and then he hung a curveball and uh, just tried to put my best swing on and get the result that we get. Compared to the first two days, uh, it seemed like y'all were barreling things up a little bit more today. Yeah. Do you kind of feel like uh, the outcome like this was maybe due? I mean, it, it's baseball, you know. Baseball doesn't always go the way you want it, and you just kind of have to know that. I mean, we all in the dugout, and it, even in the locker room after those first two games, I mean, we just had to believe in each other and just stick with it and know that one through nine, we're going to, if you don't get the job done, somebody else behind you is going to come up, come up and get it done for you. And uh, you have to believe in that and believe in yourself and just believe in all your brothers. So it, it just kind of, nothing really changed throughout the course of the days. We just had to stick with it and know that that's how baseball goes sometimes. A little extra incentive to get a run across when you know you're going to set off the cannon out there? Yeah, that was, uh, that was a good little touch to it today. That was really awesome. That was a, that was a really cool thing. So. What did you think of the fight show by the team? There really didn't seem to, to be any like give up in the dugout. What happened? Uh, what did you think of the fight show by the team? Yeah, that that was uh, that was really amazing. I mean, one through nine, the first inning through the ninth inning. I mean, I felt like we were there emotionally, physically. I felt like we were all there. We were ready to come out here today and play. And man, did we want to win? Oh, we wanted to win. So that was that was a really good one. Talk about the performance from the game. Oh my gosh, dude! I mean, first Chris. I mean, he pitched. Even though it didn't really go to what he would have called good, I would still call that an amazing job today. I mean, he pitched lights out. That was awesome from Chris. And then Evan to come in and just really just throw strikes. That's what we've been talking about, just throw strikes, pump the pump the strike zone, and just let the let the defense behind him do the work. And as, as you saw today, Hunter Haas, I mean, you, you can't get any better than that. That was awesome. And uh, honestly, hell of a job to Evan. That was, that was awesome. Yeah, with Evan, Coach said, Y'all already have been able to get some swings on him in practice a little bit. Is, is, was it a, maybe a little bit, not out of left field, but, but, but a, a welcome surprise from him today? Not at all. I mean, I feel like all of our pitchers, if they come out of the bullpen or if they start the game, that's what every single one of our pitchers can do. And, I mean, you just have to believe that every time they come up. It's never a surprise. We know what we have here, and we have the best pitching staff in the nation, and I'm not shy of that at all. And I believe that to my fullest of heart, so not a shock at all. Things swirling a little bit in the outfield, wind-wise, defensively? Um, I would say that uh, we're a little bit used to it just because we practice here every day. But if you're uh, not used to how the wind goes here, then, yeah, it can uh, it can catch you as a surprise. But other than that, I felt like the outfield did a really good job today. JT, me, Caden out there, I mean, I felt like we really played the balls correctly and did what we needed to do, and it wasn't too bad today. Wait, plays, you just kind of change directions? Yeah, I mean, especially – Right now is not too bad, but whenever it gets more into the summertime, the wind will just start howling out there, and it'll give you a different kind of direction, especially balls to the line. They'll always come back in, and we know that, and so it's a little bit easier on our part, right? Uh, so it's not too bad. How do you carry the momentum from this win over to the next week? Honestly, just trusting our routine, trusting what we did this game, and just, like I said before, believing in each other and believing that we can do this and believing that we're the best team in the nation and nobody can tell us different. This might sound repetitive, but trust our routine, you know? I mean, I, I say it a lot and because we talk about it every day. We work on our routine every single day, and that's just what we need to do. And we work on being the best hitters that we can possibly be through our routine. So if we trust it, then we know we'll be fine. So.